Hey there again guys, um, it's Amy and today I am going to do a what's in my purse video. I really enjoy watching these, I think that they're fun and I'm nosy and I like to see what's in people's purses so not sure how exciting mine will be but we'll see. So my bag that I'm using and that I've been using for a while is this coach bag. I don't know what the name of the style is. Um, I got it at the Coach Outlet um, years ago and kind of before I understood about the problems with carrying fake bags, I used to go to purse parties or whatever and um, buy knockoffs and I never understood the problem with that because you can get some really nice knockoffs. But um, over the years I've educated myself and I, do, I am fully aware of the issues with buying knockoff shoes and handbags and clothing. And um, so I don't do that anymore. I only buy the real thing. And if I can't afford the real thing, then I can't have it. Um, that's kind of my philosophy. So, um, but, but I do go to outlets, definitely. So this came from an outlet. And, oh, maybe I'll put you guys down here so you can see better. I don't know. Oops, 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 oops. Okay. All right. We're okay, everybody. Okay. Sorry. I'm so still not good at this. Okay. So in my coach bag, I have this, which everybody thinks is a Bible. It's actually not a Bible. Um, it is a planner and I have to be careful what I show you guys because I'm a social worker and I don't want to, um, okay, I don't want to, um, violate privacy or anything, but, um, people think I am crazy for having a planner. I have an iPhone. I have an iPad. There's really no need to have a planner, people say. I am extremely, extremely a worrier and anxious and I need it written down. I write it in here and then I still put it on my calendar on my like work uh, our work database program like the calendar thing. I put it on there too. Just I need it as many places as possible. So this is my planner and I like it because um, it's small, it's compact, and then I like this little thing. I got it at Target. It's just a few dollars but I like this because you can close it up so that's that. And then I have, oh boy, a lot of pens. And one that is obviously broken. But um, once again, as a social worker, I'm constantly in need of pens. So, oh, here's the broken one. Oh boy. Okay, we'll just put that aside. Okay. Um, and then I have a post-it note that's crumbled up. Oh, with someone's name on it. Throw that away. Another one. And some more pens. And a thing. <laughs> My friend gave me uh, a detailing, a car detailing thing. So, yeah. Um, this is super cute. It was handmade. Um, and it is a Tinkerbell. I love Tinkerbell. I love fairies. But it's a Tinkerbell mirror and I love it. I guess I shouldn't show you. People always get annoyed by that. But it's got like a big mirror and then a little circle. Super cute. And then my wallet is also a coach wallet. It's a different pattern. I have the matching purse to this one. Um, but I'm not carrying it right now. But it just, you know, a regular wallet. I mean, not that exciting. The cards, you know, the, uh, what are they called? Uh, the points types cards, and then how much? Very little cash. I was just noticing I have very little cash in there, but yeah. Okay. And then, you know, other cards. So, that's that. And then more junk. And then a whole, whole, whole whole bunch of change, which I would like to get out of there if possible. Okay. I can use that for laundry. <laughs> okay. So 
so then inside my purse I have this little pocket and in here really the only thing in here is medicine which I don't need to take out and show you guys and um, a contact case just in case and then I have these two little side pockets and in this one I have like lip products so two Tokidoki lip glosses I love those they're totally not sticky they're great one of the mentha lip shines a baby lips a YSL what are these called the voluptuous candy and number four like that. It's not my favorite one. I think my favorite one is number five, but it's basically gone. And then in this pocket, this is the gum pocket. I have lots of gum. I'm obsessed, kind of. And then just a pocket back. What flavor? Watermelon basil. So that's it, guys. My purse wasn't too messy. Um, but then, of course, when I go to work, I bring my work phone and my iPhone, and sometimes I bring a Kindle along if I have a long day. I don't know. I, I've told you guys I'm a social worker, but I do contract work. I work contractually, so oftentimes during the day, I might have an appointment like at 8 in the morning, but then I won't have another appointment till like whatever time, 1 or 2, but I'm too far to come all the way home, so sometimes I'll like sit at... Um, you know, a coffee shop or Panera or whatever and just um, read on the Kindle or whatever. So, um, yeah, that's that. I used to carry a whole little makeup bag inside my purse and I stopped doing that because it was making my bag way heavier than it needed to be. And the reality is all I really ever want to touch up is lips. I figure, you know, once I'm out the door, it's too late. <laughs> so, um, yep, that's that. So that's my purse. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.